Hey guys, this is just a quick tutorial on how to make morph targets. Alright, so what we require in our scene today is a box. Um, make it 50 by 50 by 50. It'll be a good cube. Alright, I'm going to change the length segments from 10, to, uh, 10 by 10 by 10. Probably gives you the best result. Right, I'm just going to add a map so you guys can see the outline. If I press F4, there we go. Alright, so this is going to be our default. Cool. Now, this default is going to be um, really, really important, and we're not going to change it at all. But we're going to, so what we're going to do is we're going to make a bunch of copies. Um, let's make it five copies, and press OK. OK. So these, I'm just going to move out of the way just a little bit so that I can make sure that the um, the default is dif different to the morphers here. Now what I'm going to do is basically just deform these five here. Now I could deform in them in any way um, as long as I make sure that, oh wait, before I do this I have to make sure that the cube itself is converted to an edible poly otherwise I can't deform them that well. Okay, so uh, do that five um, five copies and make sure it's a copy not an instance or um, but you can probably make it a reference if you feel the need okay just move this out of the way cool all right back to where we were all right now what I can do is add like a modifier on it say if I wanted to do an FFD now if you don't know what an FFD is if I just expand this and go control points basically you grab one point and it's like soft selection now, um, if you don't know what soft selection is, basically it just you grab one point and a bunch of different points will follow to a degree. Okay, so just pull these guys in, deform them. Alrighty, I'll pull you out. Why not? And I'll pull you in and you guys as well, just a little bit. Okay. So, there's one, and what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to call it something else. I'm going to call this um, where it's deformed. So, it's deformed on the back end, which was a bad idea. So, this is actually the front here. Um, doesn't matter too much, basically. Uh, I just put them in a different area. Um, what I need you to do is probably have copied them along the right or left hand side rather than the front or back end, but not the problem. Okay, so um, I'm just going to call this back. I'm going to call this, let's go um, wave. Let's call this one front. Let's call this one shrink. And this one, noise. Alright, so I'll grab the front and I'll add that FFD again. Just click on there just to make sure you grab the control points. And I'm just going to deform it right now. Now, modifiers are a fast and efficient way of trying to deform things. Really works really well and really easily. Um, if you couldn't tell by how many times I've used the word really. The, the main thing that you have to remember while deforming these is that you cannot um, add or take away vertices because basically it goes off the count of your um, of what you've done. Now uh, this requires a wave so I'm just going to add in a wave modifier. Let's see how it goes. Okay, that's cool. Yeah, cool. I'm happy with that. Might add in a second wave as well. Uh, w wave, but we rotate this 90 degrees. Hmm. All right, not in the center. Let's go center. Here we go. 90. There we go. All right, let's add a wave. X. 
excellent. Let's change the waves to this. Let's go this phase. All right, I'm happy with that. Cool. And then we can go and select this one. Now this one's called shrink. So what we're going to do is shrink certain parts. Not all of it. I can't be bothered doing that. But you can grab certain areas and just shrink it. You can move it. You can shrink it. You can rotate it. You can do whatever you want with it. That's perfectly cool. Um, just don't add or subtract um, the areas that I said. So basically, yeah, you can get away with most things um, being um, morph targeted. Um, it's easy to do, fast and um, efficient. So I would suggest you to use it for anything to do with facial animation, stuff like that. All right, so we add a noise. Let's see what we got. Noise. And we can go seed, scale. Uh, no. Uh huh. Okay. Doesn't look like much yet. Let's just change a whole bunch of things first. There we go. Turn down the scale just a bit. Uh huh. Change the fractal. Fractal works best for noises, at least when you want to. Don't want it smooth. Otherwise, it won't work that well. Okay, cool. Okay, there's our, our modified cubes. So what we're going to do is we're going to select this guy here. We're going to go modify list, morpha, wherever it went. There you are, morpha. Okay, now go load multiple targets. If you feel like you only want to grab certain air, uh, certain objects from the scene, um, go pick object from scene. But I'm going to go load multiple targets and just grab all of these and press load. Alright, so it comes with a color legend, and basically green means good. It, it contains morph data, which is what we want, and it's targeted to the object in the scene. Perfect. Okay, now if I um, animate this, basically if I just go from um, 0 to 100 for any of these, it should, in theory, work perfectly fine. As long as I didn't add or remove anything, works perfectly cool. All right, so if I went auto key, went a zero here at 10, I went back, and then at 20, I went front, 25, I changed back to a zero, and let's see, 30, I changed front back to a zero, so it looks like that, cool. All right, and then, uh, Turn on the wave and the shrink at the same time at 40, which is going to look really weird. Cool. I can probably change the front back up again. You see how it works? So it just adds on and adds on and adds on, which is awesome. All right. And change it all back to zero. And then we add in a noise at 60. Cool. And then at 90, turn it off. But in between, at about 80, we'll add the uh, wave and then take it away at 100. So it would look something similar to this. Cool. So that's how you do morph targets. Now you can use this efficiently with um, anything to do with faces, so on and so forth. Um, go out and play more.